Little Resistance. And you know with a title like Little Resistance, there's going to be a hell of a lot of Japanese. Boot and a boot. You're going to make a joke about the title. Ooh, spoiler. Little Resistance, because they're Asian. <laughs> oh, I'm such a kidder. But, with the addition of a 15-inch bayonet, the Japanese rifle was a full six inch, was something like a full three inches taller than the average Japanese soldier. Which one would you like? Cream or sarsaparilla? Don't stab my cream. I want your cream. Do my cream inside I want of your cream inside me. Down your throat. I want it to come out my penis later. <laughs> yeah, okay. Anywho, which one would you? Oh, you're got iced tea. Fuck you then. What? Uh, yes. <laughs> I'm confused. Good. I'm going to have one of these gummers. Ew. What flavor are these? Spearmint. Ew. The glogy. Anyhow. He dies! Spoiler alert! Don't do it, Koopman! Don't do it! You can see the bunker that will storm eventually. Ooh. It was from the bunker. <laughs> it was like he got hit in the head by a 200 millimeter round, and then kind of fell That's there. That's 20 centimeters. Ooh, almost. It's three quarters uh, or two, two decimeters. <laughs> two thirds of a foot. <laughs> okay, so now you get the rocket strike. Just call him the rocket strike on the beach. There's actually in a. The Xbox version is actually an achievement. And after this, you call a rocket strike that kills at least four Japanese. That's not hard. Not really. Because it does that. But, let's get the, the Ray Master Cannon. I got despite wearing something like 60 pounds of gear, the guys still float. <laughs> Most of it being metal. Anywho, you get it by jumping in these puddles from right to left. One. Two. two three. And four. I just wait. Did it work? I hope. Yeah. Yep. You hear the music change. And then creepy voices. <laughs> I really wish I spoke Japanese so I know what he was saying. Well, Satan is my master. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now we have the ray gun. It's kind of useless, but... Fun to use. Yeah. Anywho. Normally, if you went up there immediately, there would be dead Japanese. There would be, like, guys on fire stumbling around. There's a Type 99 light machine gun next to you. Two of them. If you want those. Okay. Whoa! But yeah, essentially it's the ray gun. Not really useful for a novelty. You may want to get a. Uh, I don't. Let's gun. show them the reload. You put new batteries in it. That grenade's gonna kill you. It almost killed you. You may want to go back and get the. Um, Type 99. Yeah, there are two of them. Back where you were hiding. Looks like something from the fucking Jetsons. Anywho, there's two of them, one on either side. And he picked up the other one. And the ray gun. The ray gun symbol is a 45. Okay. But you're essentially just gonna want to move up here. Okay, you're gonna move up and move slightly to your left. This would be another great place to have a death card, but no. Because, I mean, look at it. There's a, there, well, there should have been a body, but that's... All right, now you gotta throw, like, flame. I believe you have to throw smoke grenades in front of that bunker. No, that's later on. Ah, uh, yes. Now, if you can see, the, the mag release actually has a hole in it. That's because on the back of the mag were little, a little counter that lets you know how many bullets were still left in the gun. Which was kind of a useless addition because nobody had time to look at it in, in the middle of a heat 
pit battle. Oh! Did you get instant death? I no, I just got shot from an ambig an an ambiguous angle. Yes. Trench gun too. Don't charge them, you nyaga. Run! Thank you for meat shielding your buddy. <laughs> it was valiant effort, but I still killed him. Oh, uh, is that it up there? I like how, despite being hit by a friggin' uh, despite being hit by a thirty out six round. The guy just sort of like trips, like, ow, I into my knee. Keep pushing. You can actually set how many shells you reload by just stopping the reload halfway through. But this is the Gib Factory. I'm not sure what a Gib is. Giblets. Or why I should give a fuck. Alright, as you type 99. More type 99 sort of half buried. If you turn your head 90 degrees to the left, it kind of looks like one. Yeah, it is, actually. But you have full ammo, so it doesn't matter. When I first started playing FPS games and I didn't know what the Type 99 was supposed to be, yeah. I thought the little wooden handle thing yeah. that's right there, it was like a fire extinguisher. A fire extinguisher? It was like an attachment. <laughs> really? Alright, now... We'll show you a bonsai attack here. If we could not kill all the guys. He gets up there and just flops back down. Normally, if you shoot them, they'll just sort of like fall. This is a bonsai strike. Yeah, it's like the dogs in Call of Duty 4, but infinitely easier to deal with. Because you can just sort of mash the button as opposed to hitting it at the exact moment. Actually, no, on PC, you can't mash it, unfortunately. In Xbox, you, have, you can just easily mash it. I'm just like flipping the jab through the air. It's like wrestling. Now we're going to be coming up relatively quickly on the... What the fuck? He just ran over the barrels. <laughs> uh, we'll be coming up soon on the... Where the death card will be. You're not dead yet, but we'll kill you. There you go. You're dead. We'll put you out of your misery. <laughs> anyway, they can't... They kind of ran really straight. Now if you run out of this bunker and... Clear the guys up with a, with an artillery strike, actually. That's what I usually do, is I'll take an artillery strike to them. Head into the bunker all the way to the other side. But first, the death card will be right, right there. Right there, in that corner. Okay, but head over here. And you're now going to spawn camp the enemies. Okay. Keep going, there's more guys back there. Hold on, I gotta reload. My <laughs> Wait, look reader. at the ground. Look at the ground. Need a hand? Oh he my was God. masturbating before he died. There's a guy on the ground. He did. How did you die? This I think this might be an original place for a death card because no one killed him. Yeah, maybe. Because he's been back here, no one would have killed him. But look, wait, keep going down that tunnel. You are where you're supposed to have gone anyway. You yeah. could have gone in the middle or you could have gone that way. So but, I don't know if that would have been a death card because it's sort of like on the path. As opposed yeah. to where everything else is just sort of off the beaten path. Okay. Oh, they should have gone up behind him and tried to decapitate him. Okay. So now you need... No, not yet. I'm reloading, I'm reloading. You need to get on the... Um, you can get on the machine gun to kill these guys. But which is a lot more fun and easier. These guys. Okay, machine gun the rest of them. Wow. I like how they were so dedicated to be able to stay on the uh, <laughs> the mortar despite having giant naval shells dropped on their heads. Yeah, well, they're Japanese. They they're used to being under pressure. You're not too good in school. You'll cure yourself. We make more. Okay. Can we beat this level in the time slot? Absolutely. Let's kill this guy first. We already did. I already sent it in. Okay. Let's wait here for this dude. Come on, let's, we have, let's, we we have, we have 70... We have 65 seconds. Okay, turn around, turn around. Get ready to kill him. Get ready to kill him. Ready to kill him. Get ready to kill him. 
down, Sarge. Secure the surrounding area. Aim. Aim. Orders. We rest. Sue Kowalski. Ah! Now watch. He goes flop. If you shoot him even just once, he'll stab him and then flop. <laughs> he had to get that last little stab in. But Captain Fuckhungry just ran body first into a... Shotgun. No, just Fuck ran... Shot. Just ran body first into a katana. Alright. Well, I'm anyway, gonna stop you! Uh! This is Twilight Fox 109. Game for Roger 6 War, signing we'll out. We'll back to you with Hard Landing in just a sec. Signing out.